Okay, hello everyone. This is going to be a brief intro to what a NAS is. You may have heard of this in terms of backing up your data. A NAS is Network Attached Storage. And just to help understand this, I'm going to compare this to an external hard drive. This is an, a Western Digital MyBook, completely enclosed. Uh, these are both external storage devices, so you can back up your data uh, on each of these. Now, I'll kind of go through some of the differences here. The external hard drive the Western Digital, the My Book here, connects directly to your PC. And that's the only place you can connect it to. You connect it to your PC, it's a USB connection, or your laptop or your MacBook, and it's completely enclosed, and it's just for that device. And now some of them have some other features, but in general, that's how that works. Now the difference with a NAS, a network attached storage, is this device here is going to connect Ethernet, not directly to a computer but instead to your network. So just as an example here, here's a, a router, it's not even connected up, but you can see that's the connection you would use for a NAS. Now anybody on your network would have access to the data that's stored on that NAS. Okay, so it's 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 shared. Shared on your home network. Now a couple other things you'll notice here is this opens up and there's two bays here so this would be for two hard drives so you could put any size hard drives you want and there's a lot you can do with that either you could just have double your storage or you could use redundancy so one hard drive backs up the other and there's all kind of stuff just to, as a point if you buy a NAS you're going to need to buy your own hard drives typically this is the way they come empty so be aware of that don't think for 150 bucks you're getting the whole solution you still are going to need to buy a hard drive or two uh, I'm just going to show here, so it's just an example. So here's here's a hard drive I have, and basically it comes out of the box, looks like this. Your connections are on one side, it's flat on the other side, and basically, you, you know, they're all a little bit different, but in some fashion you're going to slide this into the, the bay, the connections. It's a little bit difficult, actually. Not too difficult, but you just have to, there's usually, little, there's little notches here, and uh, there you go, see, and they, they slide right in there. And... So this is what you would do, is you would buy this fresh, and that's the other key thing, don't put in one that has a lot of data on it, any data actually, because when you install this, you need a new hard drive. It will format automatically, it doesn't give you any options. So if you think you have a hard drive, uh, has all your data on it, you're going to stick it in here, it's just going to be gone. So that's a, a key point. So hope to help, hope this helps. Just in summary, a NAS, Network Attached Storage, it's shared across the network. They don't come with the hard drive. You gotta, you gotta supply your own. It's gonna be formatted as soon as you put it in there, and uh, you can ha you can add as many drives as you want or the size you can kind of play with. Now the external drive, it's only directly to a PC. Um, hard drive is completely enclosed and comes with it, and it's pretty easy.